TJ and her assistant Nelly Welly. And today we're going to do a cool experiment. Scientific. <laughs> but before we start, let me tell you a little something about this experiment. An annular eclipse, often called a ring of fire eclipse, is an eclipse that happens when the new moon moves directly in front of the sun. The difference between a total solar eclipse and an annular eclipse is that during a total solar eclipse, the new moon completely covers the circular visible surface of the sun. An annular eclipse can occur when the sun has a larger apparent size than the moon, whereas a total eclipse can occur when the moon has a larger apparent size. This is what we will require. An empty box, scissors, a blade, foil, tape, a piece of white paper, a nail or something sharp to make a pinhole. And remember kids, always have an adult present when you do this experiment. Safety first! Always. Now you ready? Are you ready to start? Yes. So we'll take our box. Oh, wow. And then, you see this clear paper? So what I want you to do is trace an outline of the bottom of the box with a pencil. Once she's finished tracing it, I take my pair of scissors and cut the outline of the box that she's made at the bottom. Don't worry, I'm going to refine it after. So now to be a white paper, you know. Now we take the paper, put it into the box, and see if it fits all the way to the bottom. Till the bottom. Yes, push it all the way down. So make sure the paper is all the way inside. Can you see? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Look at it. Then after that, we'll now close the box. Yeah? So we'll take some tape. So here, hold it for me. Sorry. And then we'll close the box with it. Easy. Mm -hmm. Just close the box. Completely. Yeah? Yeah. Then I'll take my razor blade and cut a box on either side, on both sides. Huh? So here we go. And you have to be very, very careful. Because it can cut you and it can hurt you. Okay, fine. So once you've cut, can you see my well? Yeah. Cut out little boxes. The box. That's all. Let's do. Okay. So we'll take our tape foil. Uh huh. And cut out the now cover up one side. Huh? Okay. Bravo. And then we close this side with the tin foil. Cool. We can add some celery. Yeah, hold. Oopsie. Okay, me. Let me finish it a little bit more. And at the front. There we go. Stuck all the tin foil around. Eh? Wow. Then I'll take my nail uh -huh. and poke a hole. So Nelly Welly, yeah. we're going to use this to view the eclipse, an annular eclipse that is going to be on 21st of June. Isn't that cool? Whoa! I know! But for now, what we'll do to test it, we're going to go outside and go see the sun. Okay. For this experiment, you want to stand so the sun is behind you and you can see the shadow you are casting. You'll hold the box up like a flute, so that the eclipse can reflect onto the tinfoil. When you look into the other opening on the box, the sun should incrementally disappear on the white. 
paper. And remember, never look at a total solar eclipse and an annular solar eclipse with your naked eyes. Always use protective glasses or our simple eclipse viewer. Were you able to see the sun? Yes! So remember, on 21st of June, there will be an annular eclipse that will pass over our country. Aren't you excited? And you can use this to view the eclipse. This is all we have for you today. See you next time on Funky Science.